Okay, this is one of my modifications I did since my last video, and I'm still not done yet. But um, I ran this, uh, I decided that I needed more volume, so I ran this, uh, I took away the 4 inch pipe, put a bigger hole, and ran a 6 inch pipe in. So I'm definitely getting more volume that's working. The other thing I did, instead of just having the, the room air be pulled back through the fan, and then it's circulating through the stove and then back out the six inch pipe. I put this, I took the old um, four inch pipe off and it's going down off the blower that we're using for a suction device. And it's going down, sorry for the clutter here, it's going down towards the floor where everyone knows that, you know, colder air is down there and warmer air is up here. So it's taking the more, the colder air that's on the floor level instead of the hot, the warmer air that's higher up that I could feel when I hold this camera where I'm at and take a look at the temperature I'm getting right now it's freaking hot it's it's heading towards towards 400 degrees it's, it's not at least it's so hot I'm like not able to hold the camera up close to it let me see if I can zoom in that's going to come out but so what I'm going to do next is I'm going to insulate the uh, six inch pipe it does have a piece laying over loosely right now but I'm going to insulate it cover it and then I'm thinking about on the other side of this where the cold air return goes in insulate that so any temperature that comes out of the room whatever temperature it is doesn't drop on the way to the stove just you know capture the last few degrees so we'll see how that works. Thanks for